Hello everyone, we are Kraken Studios and in this video we're going to look at all the print settings for all of our tiles. In this case we're going to take one of the tiles of the Rockfield Center that we give you here for download. So whenever you're ready, launch Ultimate Kikura and let's have a look at this together. First of all, we actually give you our profile for Kikura, but you can set everything up really easy without any issues. For every single one of our files, we recommend you use a layer height of 0.2mm, wall thickness of 1.2mm, and 3 bottom layers as well as 5 top layers. Down here on the infill dropdown, we're going to use a grid pattern with 5% density. And for the temperature of our PLA, we're going to set it to 205 degrees and the heated bed to 70 degrees Celsius. For our print speed, we're going to set our infill speed to 70 millimeters per second and our wall speed to 40 millimeters per second. Last but not least, our top and bottom layers speed to 35 millimeters per second. All the way down to the build plate adhesion, we're going to select brim as our type with a line count of 20, but you can configure this for more or less adhesion. The file we have given you today is the Rockfield Center one, so we just drag and drop it to Cura or any other slicer of your preference. As you can see, it appears flat on the surface of the bed, but we definitely recommend that you print it vertically. The quality of the print is way better as we minimize that rough appearance with very visible layer lines. The only thing that you have to watch out for is the overhangs, but don't worry because we have made sure that all of our tiles print super nicely from at least one angle. To prepare the print, we just have to click on slice and wait for a few seconds. Meanwhile, on the right top corner of the viewer, we can select line type to see everything clearly. And as you can see, it prints very nicely with enough grip to the bed, thanks to the brim. Now that the slicer has finished slicing, we have an estimated time for this file to print. And four hours and 53 minutes is pretty good for a three x three tile. And like I said, we personally like to leave these prints at 0.2 layer height, but if you really wanna achieve faster prints, first thing, we just set the layer height to 0.3, and just really quickly, I'm not going to go in depth into all the changes. You just have to look on the screen and just change the speed a little bit faster and everything according to the video here. And you'll achieve a relatively faster print. We saved about an hour of printing. So that's pretty good. If you're not concerned about the quality on all the layer lines and all that, feel free to use this configuration. The last and most important thing you have to do here is save your JIT codes and take them to your favorite printer. So once again guys, we are Kraken Studios, we hope you enjoy this piece and we will see you at the stadiums.